I see that you are finally awake. Took you long enough. You seem a little confused about your whereabouts, but worry not. You're under my care now, and everything will be explained to you soon. Where are we exactly? In my castle, of course. And do not be afraid. I won't hurt you. If you behave. I am Hanzo, the vampire queen that rules these lands. And you, my dear, are my new servant. <laughs> and no, that is not up to debate. You want to know how you ended up here? Well, that is a funny story. You see, I found you dying in the forest. You were likely attacked by bandits, robbed, and left to die. I felt pity for you, and I decided to turn you into a girl so you could serve me. And here you are now, but it is none of your concerns. You are bound to me now, which brings us to your role in my castle going forward. As my servant, your task will be to fulfill each one of my requests, no matter what I ask for. Oh, don't look at me like that. You'll get the rewards if you do well. Let us begin. I'll give you an easy task to start with. Servant, go fetch me a snack and make it fast. Thank you. You know, a drink would be lovely now. Has a wonderful flavor. You're a very good blood bag. <laughs> Blushing, are we? What a freak. I mentioned rewards earlier, if you recall. Well, here is your first one. Turn around and you'll receive it.
Did you enjoy the reward? Good, because I have another task for you. If you liked getting pampered, make sure to do an even better job than before. What is the task? Oh well, you just have to fetch my diary and bring it to me. It's in my studio. Oh, do not worry, you will find it. It is behind the big metal door with the red gemstones nestled into it. Now go. I'll be waiting here. Ah, you're finally back. I was getting impatient. Hand me the diary, servant. Very good. You picked the right one. Luck seems to be on your side today. Here, come sit next to me and close your eyes. It is time for your reward, as promised. Are you scared, my little servant? Maybe you should be. Look at you, all red right in the face. Don't worry, I won't buy it. This time. Look, are you afraid? Do you really think I'm going to bite you in the neck? Very well, enough with the kisses. Let's move on with your last task 
for today. Here, take my diary. What? No, you're not supposed to read it, dummy. You'll be writing in it on my behalf. That is. Are you ready? Good. Let us begin. Start with writing the date first. And open your ears. Dear diary, a marvelous encounter blessed my night. I found a dying blood bag near my castle, and I decided to take them in. I really needed a new servant after all. The vermin smelled like shit, so I gave them a quick wash before throwing them on the first bed I found. I eagerly waited for them to wake up and learn about their new life. Oh, the face they made was so priceless. I better wished I'd let them die. <laughs> Too bad. I'm not unmerciful. While they were sleeping, I thought to myself, how could they be of use? And well, besides being my dinner, I figured that a butler was much needed around here, as well as any other task I might think of. They better have a lot of stamina. The castle does not clean itself. Oh? Are you not liking my narration? <laughs> Tell me. When did I ask about your opinion? <laughs> Correct. I did not. Shut up and write. Where were we? <clears throat> Although my new toy looks really weak, I am positive about them getting stronger. I will make sure to train them well. Not that they can refuse. I ought to think of good incentives to make them work hard every day. A reward? Perhaps? Yes, that sounds like a great idea. Oh my, I am so smart. We closely monitor directions and offer a wide variety of composition when my orders are being followed. And if they try to stay top of line, well, it's free game for me, of course. Are you done writing? Oh, let me check. Your calligraphy is hideous. I will have to teach you how to properly write on a queen's personal diary. But we will think about that later. I did mention this was your last desk. After all, you're expecting a reward. And despite your horrendous way of writing letters, I am going to keep my word. Come here now and move it. You don't need to close your eyes this time. If you don't want to, you might get scared otherwise. Well, what are you waiting for? Sit next to me. I will give you a hug.
Alright, enough with it. It's getting late and I have errands to run. Very important errands. Your presence is not required. You're way too weak. I will let you rest now. But I suggest not trying to do anything stupid while I'm away. If you try to run, I will know. And I will find you. Understood. <laughs> Very well. I bid you farewell, my little bloodbag. See you soon.